Hey everyone, it's Adam from Shopify WordPress Tech. Uh, today we're gonna cover a very uh, important important topic, which is the security of your website. If you are a creator or a builder to a WordPress um, website or blog or a store, you need to secure your website or your store or your blog with a very uh, intensive um, security plugin. So I'll show you some data today. This is one of my site. It's uh, still under construction. When you go to the site, it shows you that it's still under cons under construction. But yet, you don't believe how many people try to hack this site. I don't know why, man. I don't have any users. I don't have any data that they they can take from it. I don't know. I don't have any uh, financial information on the site. Or it, it, it's just a WordPress site with the theme, and that's all. No information. It's it's a, it's a startup. It's it's a new. So today there was an attempt five times today. By the way, today is Tuesday, the 5th of January, 2021 and Happy New Year, everyone. So today there were five attempts. Uh, in a week, I had about 104 attempts. And in a month, there were 619 619 attempt. I don't know what they're looking for, the, the, these guys. So the the, the uh, plugin that we're going to use to protect the site is the same plugin that I'm using it. I tried different ones, but this is the, this is the best one. Uh, they have a free version, but I suggest that if you have a data on your website, you need to buy the premium one. So I'm just going to show you some data from the same uh, website, which is Word, WordFence. So in the last 30 days, there were attacks. They, they, they blocked attacks of over 3 million sorry, 3 billion and 747 million and 92,999 attempt. So they blocked over 3 billion attempts on their on the websites that they cover. So I don't know what the people looking for these ha these hackers. So their price is it's not really bad. So as I say, they have a free version, but I suggest to buy it from them. So it is not an affiliate. They're not going to pay me for this video. So I'm just doing it because I love it. I tried different ones. I didn't like them. So for like three years, I've been using WordFence now, and it's great. So the price is $99 per license, and it's good for one website but if you want to buy more you get discount like two to four licenses you got 10 percent off and it's going to be 89 dollars per license if you have or if you're doing it this for clients and 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 the clients willing to pay if you have 15 if you're buying over 15 licenses uh you get 25 percent so you're gonna pay almost 75 dollar uh, per license, but I suggest that you buy it uh, either from the plugin that we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna implement right now, or from their website is a wordfence.com, and it's it's very good, it's handy. As I said, my website is is just a new and it's under construction. Like if you if you go to Sour Chat right now, maybe I'm gonna launch launch it launch it soon. 
but as of as of today as of now at nine o'clock 9 p.m it's uh, still under construction so when we go to the site again we see about 619 attempts in the last month and 100, 104 in the last week and five today and this some data from the uh, wordpress network they blocked today 5 million within uh 24 hours or less over 5 million so when we go to the 30 days 120 million so sometimes it goes up sometimes down it depends on the day um and the uh, the time so when you go to tools you're gonna see who is attempting to log into your website so i'm not going to show you all of them <clears throat> so the first the first attempt is um uh, from russia it's six hours ago they tried to log into the website i don't know why and it's a human so this from Russia and that's from Russia. This from Indonesia. Indonesia. They try to log into this site. There are there are a bunch of them, a lot of them. So I'm not gonna show you everything. So let's head to the uh, other website that I'm working on it, and we're gonna. Uh, use the same plugin so we'll go step by step to to show you how to um, how to use it so first thing we need to log in to the to the back end So by the way, this user is going to be deleted soon. That's why I call it delete soon. So it's just for the demo purpose. We're going to log in. You see, as soon as I log in, there was there's no second um, security um, implemented. You just log in directly. So you go to plugin, add new. And then in the search, look for word, sorry, word fence. And the first one, I think on the left, that's the one we're looking for. It's the word fence security firewall and a malware, malware scan. The author is word fence themselves. So we're going to install it. And then activate. So once it's activated, they need your email address to send you the information. So the email address we're gonna use is whatever whatever is there. And then we can answer no. We don't want um, any information or anything. But if you want to join the uh, WordPress WordPress security mailing list, you just click yes, and then check on the um, terms and privacy policy. Just mm -hmm. click continue, and then click no. If you are not buying the premium. So it's going to be on the left hand side. And it was at the bottom. 
So you go to the dashboard. If you want to follow the the instruction, you just keep clicking next and then next and then next and then next and then you go from there. The the most important thing I want to show you is to prevent hackers from logging into the back end of your um, of your website is um, go to login security. And then set up the two factor authentication, which is how it is work. Um, you just you just open an app, uh, the app store in, on your cell phone and then look for Google Authenticator, Google Authenticator. And then if you don't have it, just download that app to your cell phone and then add a new account which is when you open that app it's going to ask you either you want to enter the information um manually or you want to scan the the code so the easiest thing just to scan the code so i'm not going to do that I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna i'm not creating this website it's just for the demo purpose so scan scan this area and then once you scan it, so the app gonna give you a six digits number. So once you get the six digit number, you're gonna enter them here, the six digit number, whatever that, whatever, whatever the number is. So once you enter them, you then, then the act, the activate um, button gonna, gonna turn blue. So you're gonna click on activate it. So that's it. You set. And when you try to log into the back end of your website, all you have to do is just enter your username, your password. Then you, when you click enter, then it's going to ask you a second step security, which is two factor authentication. Then you go back to your app on your cell phone, open the Google Authenticator, and then choose the uh, WordFence website that you just added and there will be another uh six digits because these numbers change every 10 seconds it's about 10 seconds it change so if you don't if you don't follow up quickly then when you enter them on your website it will tell you it's an invalid code because you haven't done it quickly so it changed every 10 seconds and the other thing is your um your uh your computers your computer's time which is nine um 909 now and your cell phone cell phone times must match so if your your cell phone time is a 908 and your computer time is a 909 then the codes that you the codes that you're gonna get it from your cell phone are invalid so if you enter them the computer or your website gonna gonna tell you that invalid code so the time must be exactly the same time as your computer so your cell phone times and your computer times must match otherwise the codes will not work so once you enter all that and you all set so if you have a subscribers and you have um there are different administration. You can set the um, the two um, factor authentic authentication to either administrate administrators only, or editors or authors. You can check them all, and subscribers as well, subscribers and customers. So if you set them all, it's going to force everyone. <coughs> Excuse me. It's gonna force everyone to set up a uh, as a second um, security method. So the, it's gonna it's gonna force them to do that. Otherwise, they're not gonna get. Then they, they will they will not be able to log into the um, to the website. 
So once once you do that and then you log out or you try to log in again, it will it will tell you that you need the six digit code to log in. Even though you have the user number username correct and you have and you have the password correct, it will let you without the second uh security uh authenticator uh app on your cell on your on your on the, that you downloaded on your phone so it's it's very handy it's a good so <coughs> excuse me as, as i said as i showed you on, on my other website it's still under construction it's still you can see under construction and there are a lot of people trying to log in and force to log in um don't know why but um so it's good to have it it's good to to use that um once again thank you very much for watching my video so this is video very uh, important that you have a a plugin that can secure your website from hackers um if you like my video please give me a thumb up and don't forget to share and subscribe if you haven't done so and see you in another video thank you have a good one stay safe